Hey guys, Stimulus 7 here. Um, another little topic video. This one actually didn't even make a script for it because it's it's a little bit more of a simple one. I think it's a little one-sided. Um, but it's a poll discussion that I've seen many, 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 many times in the Waypoint forums, but this time I saw it from Canadian Bushman. Great, great name. Um, and it was a poll on whether you would like a permanent team doubles playlist. And as you can see, my personal opinion is definitely yes. Um, it's actually a little surprising. I really don't know why there isn't a permanent team doubles playlist. I want stat sheets and, and stuff like that on the Halo 5 player base because I want evidence for why 343 does what they do with their playlist. Or I want justification for what they do with it. What they do um, with their playlists. I, I want data that supports um, them not having the many playlists because if they had many, it would split up the player base way too much. I, I want to see stuff that supports that because obviously, at least that I'm aware of, we don't have anything that would show that. And um, it's kind of a ri ridiculous from a player's standpoint that we have su such little playlist option. I mean, it's still ridiculous. I love this game. This is probably my favorite Halo, but it does not have enough playlist variety or choice especially when compared to other triple a titles this game is so so lacking it's ridiculous um especially with uh with with past halos and how many game types they've had it's absolutely egregious how lacking this game is in in terms of game types and it's even insulting um, with how they will seconds. experiment with these solid game types that people love and they want to stay as permanent lists and then they just switch it out. They're like, oh, well, you guys had it for a week. Time to switch to another one. And it's like, and, and they say that, oh, well, if people play it enough, it'll be a permanent playlist. But that doesn't really happen with any of them. I, I, don't, I don't think that has happened with any of them, actually. I don't think any of the, the weekend or week playlists, I don't think any of those have become permanent playlists as of reaction to how much they've been played or how much they've been requested which is it's absolutely ridiculous and and as i said before it's a little bit insulting at this point um... and i find it so insanely dumb that we still have to complain about it it's been such a long time i, I mean the halo player base has complained about it for a an extremely extremely long time and in my opinion, it's frankly too long. Um, this is one of those things that we've asked 3434 for quite a long time uh, since the game, since the first day it came out. Honestly, I would say there's been uh, several requests for this from a wide variety and um, and a wide base of the amount of players. And it's just ridiculous that we haven't had anything addressing. I would love to have like a 343 blog that completely goes into in-depth reasons explaining why they won't do it and why it is the right choice. I would love to have something like that because from a com consumer standpoint, uh, with the knowledge that we have, it seems illogical to the fact of why they don't have more game types. Um, maybe we're wrong, maybe they know something we don't, but if they did, I wish we had that information so that it could shut us up. That That's the way I think. I, I wish they would if they do have that information, I wish they'd release it so that we could shut up and stop with the topic and understand why their way works. But at the moment, it seems that their way does not work. Also, another reason I think adding more game type variety and having more permanent game types would, would actually um, grow the player base. Yes, there would be more people in different game types. It may take longer to find games, but I think that there's going to be... I think that'll be counteracted by the fact that there will be a wider player race in general because I think that more variety would be would mean more replayability for people and also more variety means there's more something for everybody because people in in games like this do not like most people are not jack of all trades they're like oh tonight I'm going to play S&D tonight I'm gonna... I made a little cod comparison there but and the reason I do that is because cod has way more game types than this game does at the moment um but I'll I'll do halo for tonight I'll, I'll do it's a halo video I'll do a halo um but not many Halo players are like, oh, you know, I'm going to play Arena tonight, I'm going to play FFA tonight, I'm going to play Breakout tonight, I'm going to play Infection tonight, I'm going to play Warzone tonight, and they switch and switch and switch. I'd say that the majority of players tend to, at least after a while, maybe after they get all their ranks and stuff, they tend to uh, go towards a single playlist and tend to just stick with that playlist. Um, and 
I think that having more variety would fix that a little bit because those people that tend to stick to more playlists might might find something new that they like or people that do not like any of those playlists mainly might find something that they do like and I think that would increase the player base quite a bit I think it'd keep people coming back to the game I think it would keep more interest in the game because right now maps is not really the concern for me I think game modes truly is I wish there was more game modes and I wish there was more community stuff like forge stuff this is the one halo game I'm I've been in the past not the biggest fan of Forge stuff, but this is the one Halo game where I want as many Forge playlists and Forge integration into playlists as possible because the Forge maps in this game are fantastic. They're really good. Um, and I think that the, the Forge mode in this game is the best that it's been. And there definitely needs to be more Forge integration. And if they went the lazy route and just went with purely Forge playlists, that could even fix their issue because that, that would even fix the problem for a lot of people of needing that uh, extra variety. But anyways, this topic has been done to death. What, you know, I, I've even, I think I've talked about it in the past. But this one was more focusing specifically on team doubles. What do you guys think? Again, as I rambled on in the video, I think they need more playlists in general. But I think my, my overall uh, point would be that team doubles is a good start. I, I think that team doubles would be a great starting point that would get a pretty solid amount of players to play and come to the game just particularly to play team doubles. I think that would be a great place to start, but I think that there's a much bigger picture here, and I think that 343 needs to focus on that as well. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. Are you guys as tired of talking about this topic as I am? Because it's ridiculous that it hasn't had that much addressing at this point. Um, let me know what you think. And just enjoy the, the rest of the video because the rest of the video is a pretty awesome, awesome gameplay. I was considering just doing a purely gameplay commentary over it because it's, it's that sick. Watch, watch this comeback we have. It's awesome. And uh, see you guys next time. in 10 seconds. Rocket launcher ready. Sudden death. 